All right, people who are into skincare, it is Saturday, which means for me it is mask day. Every day of the week, I do a different skincare routine. The morning is always the same, but the evening skincare routine changes. And I'm going to link the video in the description from Dr. Idris, a board certified dermatologist, where I got all of this from. So every morning is the same for me. Now, her video is going to have a lot more information, but this is what I took from it and what I'm using from it because I don't wear makeup and stuff. I don't double cleanse. I don't use mists and essences. I don't use face oils. There's all kind of different stuff that I don't do. I don't have I don't have a, a prescription for my skincare. So this is just what I have taken from the video that will be in the description from Dr. Idris. All right, so every morning you wash your face only with water. Then serums, and I am currently using a vitamin C serum, okay? And then moisturizer, and then sunscreen, sunscreen, sunscreen. She loves sunscreen. So, Saturday. What do I do on Saturdays? Cleanser, mask, serums, eye cream, moisturizer. Now, in the video, you will not hear her mention masks. I love this pore extractor mask from uh, Philosophy. And it is salicylic acid acne treatment. I really love it. So I incorp I just added it in to one of my days of the week. So Saturday today. So all right, first thing is first, we need the proper equipment. Face cloth. Get seven of them, one for every day of the week, to wipe off the cleanser. Then pat dry the face after you cleanse. Get a nice white face towel. And most importantly, even for those men out there, you need the proper headgear. So I'm going to cleanse, I'm going to mask, I'm going to do my serums, which is the vitamin C, then the eye cream. This is the eye cream that I use, okay? This is for puffiness. And then the moisturizer. So let's get cleansing. Do your evening brush before you do all this face stuff, okay? All right, so for my cleanser, I'm going to use Vanna Cream, which is recommended by Dr. Idris. Put that in your palm, get a little warm hot water, massage it, warm it up. You got to have the proper headgear, remember that? Oh yeah, uh-oh, it's falling. It's actually kind of small for my head. I got a big head, so it doesn't always like to stay on, but... It is nice to have the hair, even if you're a guy, out of your face. Then, washcloth. Beautiful, look at this. Nice. The best way to do it. Just like that. Then, like you're in a skincare commercial. Okay. coming off. Pat dry. Oh. Okay, pat dry. Nice. Okay, now let's put you back up here for this part. Now I want a mask. Like I said, I like using this salicylic acid mask from Philosophy. Get this baby back on. With the beard, I don't have as much surface area to do. You can focus on your T-zone or just do everything. Without my glasses, I can't really see. So excuse me if I putz around with the, with the bottles and stuff trying to see. I like to massage it in. And when you mask like this, don't, don't toss that washcloth away in your... Uh, laundry basket or drying rack because I'm going to be using it after this mask dries I'm going to use it again to take this mask off oh yeah I've always wanted nicer skin I hate my skin even at 39 it's still prone to breakouts and just not looking great I kind of try to because it's pore extractor and I got big pores on my nose. Try to 
All right, this takes five to 10 minutes to dry. So we, we'll see you on the other side. Another option is while you're waiting for your mask to dry, I sometimes brush my teeth then and maybe do other non-face related evening routine because it does take a bit to dry. Five to 10 minutes is what the packaging says, but as soon as it's dry, it's ready to come off. What I like to do, just like with the face wash, use the towel, I like to massage it in. Not just take it off, but actually kind of massage it off and scrub it off to really get, you know, that active ingredient going. All right, it still needs to dry more. <sighs> yeah, just, uh, just waiting. Just a waiting. I love this mask. When I do this mask on a regular basis, I see a huge difference. Huge difference. And I'll link these products in, in the description if you're interested. I'm a big fan of the philosophy stuff. This is the um, cleanser. But you see, I'm, I'm running low, so I got some Vanna cream that Dr. Idris recommends to, to give that a try. You'll see the moisturizer I use is Philosophy. Love it, purity made simple, ultra light moisturizer. Again, I do use this CeraVe vitamin C. I have this, the CeraVe eye cream. I have this Paula's Choice exfoliant that I really like. I just got some sunscreen, I don't know. That's, it's kind of on you what products you wanna use. And I got the uh, resurfacing retinol serum that has its own day. So like I said, each day has its own routine. And I did it in a binder because I have terrible memory. So Monday is an exfoliate day. Tuesday is a retinol day. And the routine changes based on what I'm using. Wednesday is a mask day. Thursday, I exfoliate. Did I miss a day? No. Friday, retinol. Saturday, mask. And then Sunday is just cleanser, serums, eye cream, and moisturizer. So Sunday, it's no exfoliation, no retinol, no masking, kind of a lighter day. And again, the evening routine changes, the morning routine stays the same. And based on your situation, your evening routine could be very different from mine. If you have prescriptions, if you missed or use essences, use face oils and other things, she double cleanses, uses a micelle water to take off the makeup, if you're someone who wears makeup, then the, 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 the cleanser. So it's a double cleanse, micelle water, Vanna cream, and then you go through the steps. Again, Dr. Idris, video in the description. She is changing my skincare life, and I love it. This is getting dry. So almost time to take it off. All right, like the cleanser, I'm gonna go with a nice warm water. Use the same washcloth I did with, 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 the, with the cleanser. And we're just gonna take off the mask, rubbing it in to get the full effect of the mask. And we're just gonna do that until it all comes off. All right, mask is off, face is wet, hair is wet. So I'm gonna use that same towel to kinda dry off. I'm not going straight to bed. So my beard and hair will have time to dry. Oh yeah. Oh, look at that. See, I've had, since starting this process, I have a feeling there it's gonna get worse before it, it gets better. My nose is freaking out. I got this bad boy here. Couple others around here, one under my nose though. When you have facial hair, it can often uh, cause blemishes around this area. I trim this area and if I nick it with my electric trimmer a little blemish will pop up. So those are pretty normal for me around the uh, beard and mustache line. But I have a feeling there's a gets worse before it gets better because I mean my nose and over here just really angry. So now we're going to get into the rest of the routine. All right. So my hair is wet so I'm going to put the headband thing down because it's slicked back now. Right, vitamin C. Oh, I love the vitamin C. This is for skin renewing. 
It smells like fresh baked bread. I thought it would smell like citrus, but to me, that's what it smells like. It smells like fresh baked bread. And I don't, I don't know why, but that's what it smells like to me. All right, let me see my cheat sheet over here. Eye cream. All right, eye cream. Here it is. Get a nice amount there. Oh yeah, just like that. Happy little eye cream, making the world a better place. Okay, and after that, we got moisturizer and then we're done. And that's it, easy peasy lemon squeezy, I love it. I love it, and listen, make the binder. That's how, I, it's like a uh, pilot's checklist for when they're flying, you know, I have to have my checklist. So I know what I'm doing in the morning and, and in the evening, even though the morning is the same for me every day. And again, I do not cleanse in the morning. Now, in the video that I'm gonna link from Dr. Idris, she's gonna talk about people who should cleanse twice a day. I think one of them was like, they have like really oily skin. So again, this, my routine is my routine that I made up based on the video that I watched multiple times. It might not be your routine. It might be similar, but you might have added stuff. So guys, happy, better, fresh, renewed skin. I love it. And uh, I'm going to keep it going because I've always wanted better skin. Please like, share, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.